in the last example, it was very easy to recover from this mistake because we hadn't made a commit yet based on the changed documents. What if you have made a commit or maybe even several commits? Is there a way that you can revert a bad commit? I don't know if any of you have taken a look at the US Constitution recently, but boy, that thing is a mess. Um, so I decided to take it upon myself to fix it a little bit. So uh, one thing is there are some misspellings in there, like spelling choose, C-U-S-E, so I fixed that. Um, also, there's like some, a real need for some serious editing here. For example, you have the uh, 18th Amendment, which prohibits uh, alcohol, and then you have the 21st Amendment, which repeals that one. So there's just like a lot of unnecessary verbiage, so we need to get rid of that. And then, of course, the whole reason for us to uh, become independent from Britain was so that we wouldn't have to spell with all those extra U's and everything. So um, I decided to take that out as well. And I also decided that um, it would probably be like a good idea to appoint myself president for life. So I just, you know, I put in an extra amendment about that. And of course, with all these changes and everything, I, I had to do some renumbering because of the whole stupid Roman numeral thing and all that. So, um, so that's all great. I think most people would agree these are all positive changes, although there might be some people who would have an issue with, um, with uh, my new uh, amendment appointing me president for life. So if you have um, some commits that have already been made that you don't like. Um, there's no way to just right click on changed files and make things go back the way you could when you hadn't made a commit. It is possible, however, to revert commits. Um, when you revert a commit, you're essentially taking the changes you made in that particular commit and rolling them back to the state they were in before. It is not advisable at least for beginners, to go back and try to revert commits early on, unless you revert them backwards, starting with the most recent one. So if I, for example, wanted to get rid of appoint Steve Baskoff president for life, I could start with my last commit and right click on it and say revert this commit. Now, one thing that you'll notice is it doesn't actually undo what I did. Instead, what it does is to create a new commit that basically reverses the situation back to the way it was before. Uh, so this has now rolled things back to the commit where I was appointed president for life. If I want to revert that commit, then I right click on it and say to revert that click, uh, that um, change. And so now you see it's removed that statement right there. So if you're going to revert commits, you basically need to start with the most recent one and revert them backwards one at a time until you get to the one you want. Once I have um, finished rolling things back, then I can uh, go ahead and push to the origin. And so now the um, document as it currently stands is, uh, has removed this amendment. However, you will notice that the renumbering that I did after that is now gone. So for example, uh, the 21st amendment is still missing because I took it out, but the renumbering that I did later is not there and I'll have to go back and uh, redo that.